Hello YouTube, this is Mr. MW209. Um, basically, we're going to start off with um, tutorial number one. This is from a VB.net tutorials. Um, we're going to go from starter to advanced um, throughout the tutorial um, videos. So, our first video is going to be how to create an application that prints Hello World in a message box on your screen. So first you want to start off by downloading Visual uh, Studio or Visual Basic Application from Microsoft's website. Once you've downloaded it, install it, run it and uh, you'll be given this page. Once you've been given this page, you want to click on New, New Project, Windows Form Application and name it whatever you want. If you're following my tutorial, then name it Hello World. Once you've typed in an application name you be given this page which you can alter the size of the form um, and if you click on the top you'll be given properties on the right hand side so you want to go to text and rename the text to um, hello world hello world once you've done that click enter and you should see changes at the top once you've um, renamed your form application to hello world you're going to want to go to the toolbox and if you're thinking where is the toolbox you can see it on the left side um, it's on a toolbar uh, like a on the left side dot to the left side on the toolbar you want to look for a button which is this one here you want to drag it into your application um, and just move it around, resize it maybe. Um, you want to go back over to the right side or your properties and rename it to, if you're following my tutorial like I say, name it to click me. Um, and I'm just going to resize my form application. There we go. Once you've done the layout of how you're going to do your application, you want to start with the code. And I mean, if you start it now, this isn't it. This button does nothing. All you have is a window that does this. The button doesn't respond to any event. And by events, what I mean is there's different, several different events that you can use. Um, I mean, as you can see, these are all the events that that can be used. Um, but our, our event that we're going to use in this video is going to be on click so when the button 1 is clicked it's going to respond with whatever code below it and then it's going to end the sub which is going to end the code so whatever is threaded next will start um, so basically we're going to just start off with a message box and with message box you could put message box dot show with an open bracket two quotations and a closing bracket you could do it like that or you could do it like msg box with an open bracket two quotations and a closing bracket to me i rather use um, msg box um, because it's simpler it's more smaller um, so i'm just going to start off with hello world Um and once you've typed hello world in between the two quotations you should see hello world should be red if it's not in the two quotations it will be um, let me show you it will be um, it will just be black if it's not within the two quotations and you will get an error as you can see so that's why it must be in within the two quotations if it's within the two quotations and you debug the application in order to debug the application you can either hit F5 on your keyboard or go to this uh, green play button here click it and as you can see it's loaded then you want to try and click button 1 which is this here and if it responds with hello world your application 1 your first application is successful 
and as you can see my first application is successful for this tutorial so thanks for watching my VB first tutorial um, and be sure to subscribe and like the video for more videos um, tutorial number two should be coming pretty soon thanks bye